all. I hope you're having a great day. If you're new, welcome. This is Live and Laugh with Linda. I'm Linda. And on this channel, we celebrate life in every aspect and in every way we can because I believe in my motto, Proverbs 17, 22, a joyful heart does good like a medicine. Isn't that the truth? Um, so that's what we do here in all kinds of different ways. Um, returning people, give me one of these. And new people, please consider subscribing. I would love to have you. Okay. Well, y'all, I just, I wanted to have a little Q&A kind of answer thing. Um, I was going to try to do that. And I apologize for last night. I was supposed to do a live stream last night. Um, but it just didn't work out. Um, some of y'all know that my husband has dementia. Uh, and it's a strange kind of dementia. It kind of comes and goes. <laughs> uh, it's not in the advanced stages, but I, I not, I don't really ever know what's going to come up. And some things came up and I just knew it wasn't going to happen. And so I apologize and I thank you for your patience. But I, I was going to do a Q and A and talk about a few things, but I thought I'd go on ahead and do that, uh, in this video today and go through your comments and all the things like that. Um, I can't thank you enough for your kindness in your comments. Um, all, all down the road, in, in, in anything that I've had come, come uh, by me, uh, in my fibromyalgia flare-up, such kind words and prayers. Y'all are sending prayers my way, and I so appreciate it. Um, all, the, all the dementia videos I've done, y'all just say beautiful things. And I'm just so thankful. I'm really, really thankful. Um, so thank you, thank you. And you inspire me, you inspire me to get on up and go about it. And that's what we should do, y'all, inspire each other. Isn't that the truth? In fact, you guys make me smile. That's what I'm gonna say today. Um, but I wanted to touch on a few things a few of you have said. Um, and let's, let's, just, let's just look at it and see what we have. Um, I've had multiple people give me all kinds of cleaning tips and things. Um, the funniest ones are the ones that say, I just don't do it. And I love that. I just love it. Um, I've had a couple comments about the, uh, the, uh, from people that don't want to do it. That don't want to clean at all. And I understand that. I understand that. I'm tired of cleaning too. <laughs> uh, one lady said, um, one lady remarked and said, I've never heard anybody on their deathbed say, I wish I'd have cleaned more. <laughs> that was really well put. That was really well put. I hope you understand that I certainly am not trying to get get anybody to turn into a, a, a clean freak uh, at any stage in life. But I was just trying to offer some ways to stay ahead of it in our older years. Um, and and it, to each his own. To each his own. I don't function well if things, not so much uh, uh, speak and span, but more organized. I just, I can't live in, in clutter and all of that, but that's me. That's me. So I hope nobody took offense. Um, and so there was, there's that. Um, I couldn't sell anybody on washing dishes by hand, y'all, as, as I imagine that. <laughs> Cause one of the chips I said, if you have arthritis, um, and your hands hurt every once in a while, just wash your dishes by hand and get that hot water on your on your knuckles and everything, and it just feels wonderful. But I had multiple people saying, mm -mm, no, I'm out. No, not doing it. And I, I totally understand. <laughs> ah, to each his own. Again! <laughs> In my uh, frugality videos, uh, if, if you've seen any of those, I, I show my uh, little spreadsheets I make on, on my uh, laptop on my computer and run off of all of my finances and how I do that and budgeting and everything like that. And also I do, uh, um, when I'm showing you my daily planning schedule, I do all of those tables and spreadsheets um, on my laptop and someone wants me to show how I do that. So I'm gonna make a video about that coming up. If you wanna watch all of my faith-based videos, they're on a playlist on my channel. Now I mention God all the time in all my videos. Y'all know I y'all know I love Jesus. That's who I am. But I try not to preach at anybody on most of my videos. But in the playlist that says pray with me, 
in that playlist, in that playlist are specific videos on prayer, how to pray. There's three in that series, how to pray is a series. Pray with me when I just pray the word of God and I sit there and pray right on the video. Um, I've got some other things coming up in that line as well. Probably going to start having a Bible study in the fall and different things like that. But if you really want to just watch that, that just, just, just watch that. I'd never wanted to have just a faith-based channel and keep it all faith-based. All my channel, all my videos are faith-based <laughs> technically. You know what I'm saying? Um, but because I wanted to relate to everybody. Um, so, it, but that's why I made the playlist, which is like on your channel, a playlist is like a folder. It's a folder and it's, it's just like a playlist on your, on your phone of your songs, iTunes and everything. And so if you want to just watch total of that, if you were looking for some of that, just go right on to it, go right on to it. It's right there. Um, I will tell you that I had multiple people warn me about praying on a YouTube video, about talking about how to pray and all the things. And, um, that I would get some real bad backlash because people are people. <laughs> and I had to know that going in. Once you put yourself out there, you can't boo-hoo and cry to get your feelings hurt, right? In all the time that I've been doing the Pray With Me series, porch praying and, you know, y'all, I'm not porch praying right now because it's 110 degrees outside and humidity is a billion. So you won't see me swinging in my swing or you won't see me rocking in my chair so but in in that series <clears throat> i've only had two negative one of them and they're short they're short too they don't carry on and rant and rave one person just said there is no god that was it <laughs> okay and then another person uh was a little bit longer and said a little um some other things. I've been very pleased about that. I haven't had, hadn't had much at all. Most of y'all are so kind and sweet, and I just love y'all. I, I, it, it's, it, it's not what I thought it would be. I'm coming up on a year on YouTube come August, and y'all have blessed my, my socks off. As I am right now recording this video, um, I am up to 302 something thousand views and I have over 7,000 subscribers. Y'all, I'm just a little old lady and I'm not even doing anything heavy technically. <laughs> I just thank y'all a lot. I really, really, really do. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Oh, okay. I did want to mention one thing, y'all. Somebody suggested, made a comment on one of the cleaning hacks videos, uh, suggested that we try, that I try shaving cream in my shower, that it would just clean it right on up. Well, you know, I said, that's weird. Okay, well, I'll give it a shot, you know. So I got, went to the Dollar Tree and got some shaving cream that didn't cost hardly anything. And I sprayed it down. You know me, all, I'm all or nothing girl. I just didn't put a little bit. I just, I have never had such a mess in all my life. That stuff multiplied, and when I it, it, and when you, it just kept sudsing up, and you couldn't get rid of it. I'd spray and spray and spray with water, and it just kept foaming up. I don't know what kind this was. Um, all I can say is it really didn't do it for me. Um, yeah, God bless you, whoever gave whoever it works for, do it. And you know what? After all of that. I had to clean my shower all over again because I didn't even clean it. <laughs> uh, yeah, I don't have a whole lot of uh, that. But cleaning my bathroom is my hardest job, and I was not amused to have to do it all over again. But thanks for the tip. I tried it. Mm -mm, no, not so much. All right, so I have um, a few things coming up soon I'm going to let you know about. I did do a little DIY project, and by little, I mean very small. As you know, I'm not a DIY craft girl. We've talked about that before. But I thought I'd try something small. And so I did. Uh, Hubs helped me a good, a little bit. Um, and I'm going to, I'm going to be posting that this next week, uh, hopefully and get that all edited out. Also, I'm fixing to do a hymn sing. Uh, some of y'all have said that you love the old hymns in church. Uh, we all grew up, uh, with them, didn't we? Uh, so I'm going, I'm going to sing a little bit and play my piano a little bit and I'm going to get y'all to join in. That's coming up. Um, also, um, <clears throat> I've got several new, new topics coming up. Um, and some things going on. 
but I'm real excited uh, about everything about the channel. I know God led me to it, and I know that God led me to you, and that you're such a blessing. Y'all, if you're sitting in your living room right now, and you don't think you're contributing to anything, that maybe you're not serving a purpose, stop thinking that. Stop thinking that. Stop it. Because you are serving a purpose. You're blessing me. And a lot of you have been praying for some of the things people's put on there. That's a wonderful, wonderful thing. Thank you. Y'all be blessed. Find something to smile about. And I will see y'all next time. Bye now. <laughs>